I've gotten a couple of requests from you guys out there asking me to record a video showing what you need to do to make your Wicked Pixie theme more like mine. First, we're going to head over to Wicked Pixie plugins. We're also going to have Wicked Pixie installed. Might be a good idea. For me, these are the plugins that I use. I don't use Ask Apache for Google 404 because I like the one that Chris has supplied us which says we can't find the droid you're looking for. Here's an example of it. All that loads. Um, I recommend having this that way if you put in a just like a link it'll automatically do it. Chitika is a ad service just like Google AdSense but I feel you make more revenue and the reason I have this disabled is because if you don't make ten dollars by the end of the month say you're having a bad month or something they don't give you any money at all. Google, you can just keep saving up until you want your check to be sent, and that's why I'm using Google. FAF Album is for your Flickr photos. Contera is another uh, ad service, but it places ads in your text. Uh, you might see Chris do it or other companies. Again, I don't use it because they ask for your social security number, and I'm not giving that out to anybody. No follow navigation. To tell you the truth, I don't even know what this does. W uh, P or WordPress page navigation. I recommend you turn that on. Otherwise, it's just like your uh, navigation doesn't work as well. StatPress that monitors how many people you get or hits your website gets. Related posts is really nice because it shows. Um, if we go home, it'll show related posts based on your tags and your categories. So those are all the Wicked Pixie plugins that come with it and configuring them all in one CEO pack you really don't need to configure this at all so you can modify this to any way you would like. Auto hyperlink I usually leave it just so it hyperlink stuff it puts it right in there I believe that's how I have it FA album. For this, you are going to authorize your Flickr account and you're going to get your authentic authentication code. And for that, it'll show up down here. I should probably go home, right? It'll show up right here with all your recent uh, Flickr photos, which is a very nice feature. Page navigation. I recommend you don't change anything for the page navigation, leave it how it is. But as, just make sure you have it enabled. Related posts. This is a big one. You're going to want, well for me, Chris does not write, write anything. He doesn't have related posts in. And for text, when it, there is no related post, you want to have related posts. Um, auto insert related posts. I don't do it, but it goes in automatically. And I recommend just having it the way I have it. It's perfect. Next, we're going to head over to Wicked Pixie Normal Settings, just Wicked Pixie, not Plugins. You're going to put your feed in here and the Ajax Loader. What that is, is it has a little blue circle that tells you loading, but don't use it because when you have it, it, lo it says it's loading, but if you scroll down while it's doing that, the bottom of your page is already loaded. So it's really pointless. And show author and posts if you have a multi-user blog or one user it'll tell you uh, who does it and then if you click on that author it'll take you to a page where it shows all their posts that they've like ever done so right here it's just showing all my posts um you just put your Flickr ID in all the stuff that you want to be configured if you have a podcast like it'll enable the podcast icon over here so that, that's what these are for the Twitter, Ustream and uh, all that stuff also, the Ustream is for your uh, Ustream box. Flickr ID for your Flickr box. Tweet me me on posts. To get that to do the way I have it, if I am the quick click retweet, it'll take me here and I'll say at Billy McGovern123. If for you, if you just enable that, it's going to say tweet me me. You're going to have to dig inside uh, the PHP of Wicked Pixie theme 
and you're gonna have to put in all your username stuff and if I have time in the video I will get to that post on si post sidebox that's like your related posts and stuff like that and a tweet me me global announcement this is pretty cool on your home if you have a uh, global announcement uh, like Chris had for a little while his Windows 7 uh, uh, like 70 tips it shows in a nice green box right here in your home page and it's a global announcement let's get into AdSense settings AdSense for search I never could get to work no matter how hard I tried so I recommend just skipping over that it's gonna ask you to install a table or add an ad slot and what you're gonna do is you're just gonna log into uh, adsense.google.com or adsense.com I'm not sure and you're just going to get your codes for each one of these and you're going to fill in what size it is and it'll automatically place it in your blog. It's super easy. Custom code. Custom code's really nice. It allows you to have a custom header which is this right here. My ad though I have there. Custom footer. Again, just footer, add any text you want in there. After home post and after post. After home post is your normal home page, and then after post is after you click on a post like this. My uh, after home post and normal post code is this. Questions, comments, email me at mail at billymcgovern.com. And again, I do love to hear from you guys. This video has come about because somebody emailed me. Send me your emails, guys. Questions, comments. I read them all. I respond to very much all of them unless they're rude or just unnecessary emails stuff like that send me your emails I read them faves manager your faves page is right over her for that um for me I've set up my YouTube my uh, Twitter techno buffalo chrisperillo.com and it's me Morpheus this is basically what I do every day so you can, it'll um, come over here and add it automatically from the RSS, sort everything out. One thing I've noticed though, Twitter doesn't work ever. The only reason that this is working over here is because it's a different plugin made from a different person. Other than the, from the Wicked Pixie or Faves, or it doesn't, in, it's not included in the theme. And miraculous, or like, I don't know how it did it, but it automatically came up here all by itself, and I'm not messing with it because it works, and I'm leaving it. So, yeah. Just that, know your RSS and all that URL stuff. Home editor, well, let's head over here.